adopted into a loving family. Although there were trials while growing up, this family, my parents, loved Jesus, and they taught me to love him too. I asked Jesus to come into my heart as a young child. I went to church with him, and I gained a head knowledge through memorization of scriptures. But until I was 15, I only had this head knowledge. I didn't really have a heart knowledge. My faith was followed after my parents. When I was in high school, God became real in my life. I went to a Christian high school, and as we were trying to raise God up in our lives, Satan was trying to bring him down. As God became real, I started journaling. I started paying attention in church. I started growing more in God. I learned what it meant. I began to learn what it meant to live a life worth living. That is living a life worth Christ. As most people, I have gone through many trials. I see how Satan attacks through the trials. I also have seen how God provides and prevails. One of the messages I remember from a chapel in high school was about joy through trials. In the book of James it says, Count in all joy when you face various trials. Through the testing of your faith produces patience. That is a lesson I learned that has stayed with me ever since. I learned that we are going to go through trials, but God desires us to look to Him and cling to Jesus. Many times I have wandered away from God, but He is always pursuing me, teaching me to pursue Him every day. In college, He took away two people in my life that I was looking to before God. He took away my boyfriend, and He took away another best friend. He taught me to look to Him first before I seek others. The pain of lost friendships is something I had to work through. God has brought healing in my life and has showed me reconciliation. He has brought many friends in my life that I'm thankful for. I am blessed, so very blessed with these friends. When I was in college, God showed me that that was my mission field. That helped me so much to stay in school. I can take any image from my life and that is my mission field. At work, at school, at a store, wherever I am, I am to be the light of Christ in the gospel. He reminds me to look to Him every day, that each and every morning I only awake because of His grace and His glory and mercy and love, all these things that He's been teaching me. God has taught me that Jesus is love, that He never fails and never lets go. He has taught me about the Holy Spirit and the power that He has. He has taught me that I can grieve the Holy Spirit when I don't do the things I'm supposed to be doing and I know that is wrong. He taught me that I am to do whatever I do for Him and Him alone. And he's brought joy into my heart, and I have learned to have Christ as my joy. In Colossians 3.23, it says, And whatever you do, do it heartily as to the Lord, not to men. I have learned to do all that I do for God, and not for my parents, or for myself, or for anyone else. I do it for God and His glory. The growing in Christ never stops. Anything good in me, I must attribute to Christ and His glory alone. So what's your story? about his glory you gotta find your place in the history of grace yeah what's your story about his glory come on find your place